welcome to the final video, the sixth video in this uh, video series for beginner guitarists. So this now essentially would be if, let's say, you watched the very first video of mine, that was the very first video you ever watched as a lesson, this would be a sixth. That's really cool. Thank you so much for going through the whole series so far. I hope you've learned a hell of a lot of information here to how to play your guitar and you're feeling a little bit more, a lot more confident actually on your guitar with strumming, with chord changes, understanding the guitar and all the parts of the guitar and everything else that goes with this incredible instrument. Um, I really hope you have learnt loads in this series. So the final lesson here is, I'm going to show you quickly, in the previous couple of lessons, I think it was in lesson number four, we did some chords. The chords were E minor, if you remember, and G. Right? Now, this is the cool thing about this. There are two songs that I can think of right now, off the top of my head, that have just those two chords in it. And you can play them right now. Okay, the first one is uh, me being a Nirvana fan, I, I also love the Nirvana Unplugged. So the Nirvana Unplugged album, you may know, I love that Unplugged album that they did for MTV many years ago, about 20 years ago now. Jesus, gee. Um, on that record, there's a song called About a Girl, great song, and that uses the E minor and the G chords, like, like this. combination we were doing before, lesson number four, where you just got that those E minor and that G chord. Okay? How cool is that? Awesome, right? That's one song that you could now quickly go on YouTube or have a look at or some tab sites and just work it out yourself. And yeah, off you go. That's a great song to learn and that's just those two easy chords. Then and the other one I can think of top of my head is um, Oasis's Songbird. Not one of my most famous songs, to be fair, but it's not a nice song nonetheless. It's just, um, how's it going? Talking to the songbird just to tell Starts with a G. Into that E minor. Again, just two chords. Absolutely simple, but you've got a song. So there's two songs that you could definitely check out with those two chords alone. And of course, with the other chords, you can learn a whole massive array of songs. Or alternatively, you could download my two free ebooks, uh, guides. Just link, click on the link below, and I'm going to send you the two free ebooks. They teach you how to play nine of the most incredible open chords that every guitar player needs to know in their repertoire in the first month or two of playing guitar as a beginning guitarist. So please do check out my two free ebooks. I really appreciate the support. Click on those, have a look. They'll really, really take these lessons into a whole different level, right? A completely different step. A lot deeper training that I have in those two ebooks that you love. Um, so again, thank you so much for checking out this beginner series, the six videos in my beginner series here on YouTube. Really hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, I've certainly enjoyed love teaching this. Um, this is kind of my area of going from knowing that someone literally bought their guitar yesterday or have been playing their guitar for a month or two and have been struggling. All they've got to do is watch six videos here on my channel and boom, they've kind of completely gone from struggling to being really, really uh, more confident and playing a lot more fluidly and feeling great about themselves and their fingers are hurting. Yeah, I want your fingers to hurt. If your fingers don't hurt, you haven't been playing your guitar right. Fingers are going to hurt, right? So again, like I said at the very beginning, it's all about your enthusiasm. It's all about you being enthusiastic. It's all about you having that determination to learn the guitar and not give up. Some days you're going to have a great day on your guitar. Other days you're going to struggle and you're going to go, why isn't it clicking today? I'm not very good. You know, maybe I should do this, maybe I'm not good enough, maybe my hands are too small, my hands are too big, maybe I'm too old, maybe I'm too young. All those things will come into mind. It's rubbish. Don't let any of that um, derail you and set you off to another path of giving up and letting your guitar collect dust. Because you know what? The best thing to do is just keep cracking on 10 15 minutes a day here and there if you can. That little, every little helps. So, again, thank you so much. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Do check out all my other videos on my uh, YouTube channel here. Please do also subscribe so you get all of my latest videos coming up. I've got tons of videos like um, 
technique videos, uh, beginner, intermediate and advanced videos for acoustic and electric. I do both electric as well with blues music and riffs and licks. Um, I do a ton of other cool stuff like um, gear reviews, like pedals and what gear you could use and what gear I use and stuff like that. So yeah, thank you so much. Hope you enjoyed. Do subscribe to the channel and also do make sure you check out those two free ebook guides that I'm giving away today as well. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next